Generic greetings and welcome back to Gunsmith. In the previous episode, Boots, we have some new treads. As you can see, we are producing a lot of them and this is good because a lot of the orders were for that. Uh, actually, there's an order there we can now fulfill, which is combat trousers and combo gloves. Excellent. Lots of orders to fulfill. We'll go through them in a moment. But this episode, we really want to get pretty much this line copied. This is going to be copied, I think, here. Just copy it here, uh, so we can produce combat backpacks and combat boots in. Oh, there's some on the floor there, because that's generally what happens. Yeah, we might, just might alter this, so <laughs> because it can be a bit of a nightmare at times. Like that, for example. Yeah, we, we might go ahead and uh, and change that, but we'll, we'll see, we'll see. It generally works. It generally, it's a bit chaotic, but it works. Anyway, so... Uh, first things first, we'll check a research. We can see we've just finished the uh, maintenance level there, which is good. We might up our budget a little bit to 5% to produce 22 research points a day. We've also got uh, the bullet extruder, which we'll start, because we are going to try and make uh, the uh, the 9 mil at some point. Although, a lot of the stuff that it requires... Um, a lot of the stuff it requires... I don't know if we can actually make, but anyway. So... Different orders. We decided that working for just one person was probably going to be the best uh, course of action. And I think that's a good idea. The only problem with it is because of what we're producing and how we're producing it, it might be a bit of a problem. Um, anyone that's trust neutral or trustworthy would probably go for. There's one there. Uh, 30 grand for cam camo gloves and camo vests. That's quite good, but then we have to turn on this line, and we don't have the electricity to do so. Um, well, we're going to have to get there eventually, aren't we? So, that's Jerry who's trustworthy. I will accept that task. We've also got combat backpacks. And there's just some boots, and we'll accept that and get those out the door. And obviously, reputation goes up as well. Not very good money. There you go. Uh, that's I really want to do this one. 30 grand for them combat boots and all the camo vests. And that's neutral for Major. Yeah, I, I don't know if focusing on one is the way to go, but let's just hand that in and we'll job done. Right, so, there's that. What I'm going to do is go to build menu. We've got 126 grand now, so that's good. I'm going to put some more power production in. Um, oh, you can put them right next to each other, can you? Oh, you can. Right. In that case, then. Let's do that and we'll free up some space to get one more in. Probably do the same there, but... There we go. So that should be enough now for me to turn on the glove line. Yes, that's fine. That's producing there. So producing gloves. We're producing currently here... Um, <laughs> these still come off the line all the time. Um, the only solution I can think of around here is to put even more belts facing back over. They just need to stagger a little bit, but, you know, hoover those up. Um, if I output the uh, camo vests and turn that on, will it work? I don't know. It should do so It's doing something. Mainly blocking the line up, but hey-ho. Oh, my good grief. Yeah, that's all kinds of broke. Because these are, like, weird sizes, it's like... Oh! Uh-oh! Whoa! <laughs> yeah, that's that's not working, is it? No, no, we're gonna we're gonna turn that off because um, that's just kicking stuff everywhere. I mean, it is eventually getting through, but not like we want. Hoover. That's a shame. That's a shame. When we build the line, the new line, we're gonna. We're going to have, like, two of these, I think. Um, in fact, you know what? I might do that now. I might alter this line just because it's just too much of... It's too chaotic. It's all over the place. And it's just, you know, there's no point in... Um, no point in skimping out for something when we can pretty much fix it with very little effort. Um, and money as well. So, we'll take the line. We'll knock that off. There we go. And what we'll do, take that out the back, get that out of the way, and pull that to there. 
and then we want a one meter belt and just two sores. That's all, and it'll probably still get it'll probably still get scrunched up here. In fact, it will, but it doesn't have to then try and get through that. Let's try. It can only not work, and it's worth the it's worth trying to see if it actually does something. Don't need that actually, but I'll put that over here. Because the way it's been staggered, it's okay. Because this has a really big input, you see. So that seems to be working. Um, so, come up with no armor. That needs to go. I'll keep that there, just in case there's a problem. And we're going to put this one there. This is where we're outputting the, the camo vest. Try and go back through here. It goes through. Still a bit of a throughput issue, but it is working, and it's getting rid of those, and means we're going to get fairly decent supplier there. Okay, over to orders. Um, Camo vests coming out. Available orders. There's one for Jerry. Combat trousers and boots. And yeah, we're going to go for that one straight away because it's it's twenty grand, and it's for Jerry. And check the bottom here. There's a good one. Boots, combo vests, and trousers. 33 grand. That's even better, but we just can't do it because we're not producing the uh, the backpacks. I'm just keeping an eye on this to make sure that we are getting rid of that. Yeah, we are. Well, that's fine. So we had 60 odd backpacks just not sewn because they'd fallen off the line, and that's why it's important to go back through and redo it, because essentially we'd have 60 backpacks at half complete that we're not making any money on, but now we're blasting through them all. Um, so there's 33 grand for camo vest and combat trousers. We will accept that, because that seems to be a decent amount of money for what we're getting. And then... That seems about right. Okay, so... How much do we have in storage is the question. I want to check. Um, can we check what's in storage? Is there a way? Resources, yes. Packaged items. 240 camo gloves, some backpacks, boots, vests, and trousers. Right, so that tells me that we need to turn, or we, we should just turn off the combat gloves. We're not need, we don't need to produce any more than that. That's fine. So, this is producing okay. That's working out. That little finishing will be okay. So, we need to start making the, the, the backpacks, and we're just going to copy this line. Uh, we've got 118 grand, so more than enough to do that. I think it's only going to cost us probably 50 probably 50. Uh, I'm going to go for more uh, maintenance here, just to start cheapening the line out a bit more, even though it costs us money. Uh, check the market, we can see that. Oh yeah, that's a good job I checked that. Um, 500, uh, plastic, oh sorry, 5,000 on there, and that's really cheap as well, so we'll go for 6,000. That's the cheapest I think I've seen it for. Uh, maybe not 6,000. Um, 4,000, buy that one there. Um, yeah, because it's cheaping it out, yeah. Both these are going down. Probably buy another 3,000 actually. I know we spend a lot of money, but you know, speculate, accumulate, all that. That's fine. Okay. So there's, well, there's just 28 grand straight away done <laughs> because of what we've uh, done there. That's fine. Uh, that now can be turned off. So 87 grand, probably more than enough, I think, to make this line again. So we want to make it. Do we want to put it over here? I don't think so. I think that's going to be a bullet conveyor or something. We'll probably put it, well, we are going to put it here. So build menu and start at the end of line, as always. So that goes in there. Um, make sure it's about centralised, which is there. That is fine. And again, we're going to copy this line. So we have a packager. So that's in boxing and boxing. There we go. That's in there, fine. Um, if I move it... Oh no, that, that is exactly where it needs to be. So, we're going to have the line... Do you want to do that? Or not? Or do you want put them side by side? Mm. Side by side should be totally fine, I think. That's working, so we'll just do that. So, belt was a one metre a two meter and then it was sewing um 
realistically, we could probably shift it over to the left. We're probably losing a lot of space. But then you can put utilities in the space anyway. So, and we've got all of this factory anyway. We'll probably never, ever, ever fill this factory, I don't think. So we're sewing level 2, I believe. Yes, sewing level 2. And then a, another series of singular belts. Just check on the side and make sure that is going the right way. That is going the right way. And then we've got combiners. So it is in merging. There you go. All right. And then we have two meter belts. That's going to annoy people that it's in the center of the thing. But at least it, it snaps the grid. So there's that. Um, just check in research. That is going fine. Orders. We are working on that one. It's always best to keep an eye on these, just to make sure there's one that pops up and you go, oh, I can do that straight away, and then you just hand it in. Like, for example, that one there, combat trousers and camo gloves, only nine grand, though, and we're... Mm. Actually, we could probably get that one. Yeah, we'll probably do that one, then. But look at that, 33 grand for that, though. That's really good. I'm going to take that job. And that job, I think. So... need to get that one done first and foremost because well it times out faster than the others but it's a lot of camo vests so I'll do that one because that won't affect that those two oh, it won't affect this one really too much because it's mainly the camo vests we're waiting for okay and is that still choosing camo vests? it is, right, good anyway, continue on this line so we want the combiner Sorry, the splitter, which is the opposite of combining. And then it's the former heater dispenser. Okay, so it's the former heating, and then we'll have a, we'll have a belt, and then a dispenser, like so. And then on the other side of this, we have... Is it a double? It is a double, yeah. It gives us... And we're copying that anywhere. So that's fine. So it's a two metre belt on either side. And then we've got a... Zipping. Zipping pass, yeah. So zipper. Do you think that's about right? No. <laughs> Not even close to correct. That's... Okay, yep. So we've got the zipper, we've got the cutter, and then we've got the dispenser. One, two, three, four. And that was the cutter. One of them, right? No, I didn't. I thought I had the belts right, but no. There we go. Yep. Yeah. Oh, yes. And then the dispensers. Plural. So we're going to put them on the other side. Just because of the way I've put it. Not a problem. Right, so, working back over then. So, well, just to clarify, this is making combat vests. Uh, camo vests, rather. Camo vests. So that's making camo vests, so we want to make... Backpacks. Combat backpacks. So from the front, it is... Fabric sheets... On most of these dispensers, and the part from the middle one, which is the plastic block. So, from this, it goes to cutting, then to zipping. And this one goes from dispenser plastic block, heating... And then forming into a plastic fitting. And the other one is fine. Uh, that needs to be cutting uh, cutting the field backpack. Yes. Hang on. Fabric backpack. Fa yes, fabric backpack. And then those merge into a combat backpack. 
Yep. Which then get sword, sawn rather twice, and then out the door. Okay, that's fine. So this one, this line then, is going to get renamed Combat Vest. Now we need to add another one. It's going to be Combat Backpack. We'll add all these machines. Did I deselect that? I didn't. And we'll turn it on. There we go. So that is working. I hope. I hope. Just keeping an eye on it. See if that works. Uh, it's going through. Backpack's coming off the line. And they don't seem to be breaking. Like, falling off the line or anything. Although it does look like that they are, but they're not. Right, that's fine. That seems to be working. Power's good. Right, sorted. So, uh, I will hand in which one. This one needs to be handed in first. That's for the camo vest. Uh, combat boots, we've got so many. We could probably turn that line off at some point. Um... It seems that whatever you turn off, it then requires them. <laughs> Look, it's now asking for two sets of gloves, and we turn the glove machine off. Um, I think it's been deliberately annoying. And I can't power it on because they don't have the electricity. Okay, I can I can easily sort that out, though, can't I? Just go over here, and then... It's like one, two, three, four, done. And then we'll... Uh, might as well space them if we can't have them right next to each other. There we go. Stops all the arcing. And how are we doing for resources? Fine. Price isn't great either way, so I'll leave that. Um, do you want to go for more efficiency? Not with that amount. We're going to keep on going with the, the, the bullet ones. Um, and we'll just turn the line on, I think. Come back close and just turn the line back on. Because we will accept that one and that one. Active orders, we can get that one done. Boom. There's 32 grand. And it's going to be the gloves now. So, really, it's we're producing almost everything they're asking for. There's a good one for boots. And there's a good one for boots. There's another one good one for boots. There's lot, everyone requires trousers. I'm going to turn off the boot line because we've got so many of them. I don't think we need it on. Can you not switch it on and off from there? It says add station. But that doesn't seem to... What the hell? Oh. I... Ah, that's what it means. Right, so I can just quickly click on that. Ah! Oh, that's cool. Right, I didn't know that. Obviously, because, you know, you can hear my the surprise in my voice. So let's do that then. Um, so that definitely selects that one. Yes, it does. Oh, well, we're going to do that then, if that's, if that's the case. Um, so come up vest then. Uh, we'll add a station. We'll add it there. I probably won't use this, by the way. Uh, come back gloves. Add a station. I'll probably forget about these and end up uh, using something else. Why do? Why do? I don't know why there's just not a, a toggle on and off there. Oh, that seems to be. Well, that feels like it would be a bit more efficient. Um, perhaps. I don't know. To, go to station, go to station. Add a uh, trousers. We haven't got one for trousers. Uh, trousers. Add station. There. Cool. Yeah, and so instead of that, go to station. Just have that and click that on. Basically toggle. That would probably be better. But anyway, we've got this in now. Right, so there is our other line. That is working fine, I guess. Um... Obviously, we've turned off the some of these because we just don't need them on. Not all of them, anyway. We're producing loads of stuff. Available orders, you can see we've got the gloves which I'll hand in, and the gloves which I'll hand in again. And then I'll probably... 
probably turn the glove machine off again because I don't think there's any gloves in this list anymore. There's one there for camo vests and camo gloves. The current order we're going for is combat trousers which we've completed, combat boots which we've completed and the camo vests. So we need to wait for the camo vests to finish. Um, so we're looking for things with the backpack and trousers. There's a good one there for Jerry. There's another good one there with boots as well and there's one we can hand in there I'm gonna go with I don't know probably one that gets rid of the most boots although that one pays more but we need actually we need the trousers for this one so that's fine, that's already settled that one. Okay, excellent, that's fine. So hopefully, that line, hopefully adding that is gonna help out. We do wanna add some more storage and I'll do that right now. Uh, you can increase racking by the way, there is a piece of technology that will, um, a bit of research rather. Not technology, there's some research. <laughs> that uh, allows you to increase the height of the racking. Haven't bothered with it because, quite frankly, we have enough space to do this. Now, I know there'll be certain people, perhaps yourself, that want to want me to make this, you know, a huge factory, like, I'm producing, you know, hundreds and hundreds of backpacks every hour. Well, I don't see the point because, yes, you get more of them, you produce more, it's very quick, but also it costs you more per day because you're running all the machines, and also um, it just means more maintenance, more for us to deal with, whereas at the moment it's sort of manageable, and I think it's more about, for me anyway, more about getting through this tree to um, see how far we get and such. I think that's what I'm aiming for. Anyway, so over to orders and waiting orders. We've got this one almost completed. That'll give us 30 grand. Um, this one is almost completed as well. Both of them for Torpheus. So their reputation should shoot right up, which is good. So I'm going to wait for these two to complete and then we'll hand them in. Obviously, this is producing the camo vests. This is producing the combat backpack. Uh, we're not, we haven't got the boot machine on, so there's both of them completed. One and then two. There's 60 grand just like that, which is great. Um, it's strange some of these ones are neutral with them. Um, and I'm probably going to turn off the oh, combat trouser machine, maybe? Um, trousers and boots. That's a good one for Jerry. Doesn't pay much though. That's the good one. 50 grand. But I think that one. And which one? Is he untrustworthy? I don't really want to be dealing with that one. There's a good one, but again, 300 backpacks, it's loads. Um, camo gloves and combat vests. Uh, and come over. Uh, camo gloves and camo. Best. Yeah, we'll accept that one as well. Right, so, there we are. In terms of research, we have got one more day left for that one. We've got 58 research points, more than enough to get this uh, next thing as soon as it's there. We probably have to start looking at... Um, actually, we probably don't need to look at the gas thing there. This is where you get your gas utility and water utility. Now, water is for cooling, gas is for heating. You see it says 15 there because we do have a couple of heaters. We have one, two, um, unsurprisingly, um, three. Actually, we should have four, shouldn't we? Oh yeah, one, two, three, four, five. So I don't know why it's only that. Heating takes five, and that's on 15. I don't know why that is there. Anyway, so we're gonna set research going for more, more bullet. Almost there on that one, then we could do the uh, the nine mil. And then that's a whole, this, this line here 
is going to be immense. It's going to be huge, and that's going to be a proper nightmare to deal with. But that's what we'll be doing probably um, in the coming episodes, hopefully. As always, hope you have enjoyed the video on this series thus far. By all means, let me know what you think we should change, add, chop, whatever, and um, we will go from there. Thank you very much for watching. Take care, and generic partings. <laughs>